Hey guys, Galactic Force Media and Is It Radioactive? We're gonna do a little head-to-head -to -head today with the Radio Code 110 and the Racid 7%. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take a piece of uranium ore, we're gonna bury it in the backyard, and we're gonna see which one gets the better reading. So this piece of uranium ore, I believe is from Colorado, you can find it on eBay from a great seller called Jellytronics. Great prices, great shipping. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna dig, bury, and then we're gonna scan, and we're gonna see who gets the better depth. So let's check it out, start digging. All right, all right, so just to show you guys, we're at about, ah, let me see if I can get under there, uh, eight inches, seven and a half to eight inches, in the dirt, wife's gonna kill me. Okay, so here's somewhat of a control. Uh, right now, the radio code is at just over a thousand counts per minute. We're gonna throw it in there. I'll read it to you guys. Uh, 1,000, 1 1.08 counts per minute. Let's get a dosage. Dosage is 0.11, which is pretty common here for the area of Pennsylvania, considering we have high radon levels. And let's put the racid in there now which the RACID is a little more sensitive. Let me just connect it to the app. And we're gonna do a restart. RACID's picking up. I don't know if you can see my screen, I'll read it to you. It's in the 30s, 30, 35, 36 count per second. And if I actually do the, the spectrum, it's coming up as 50% chance of being thorium-232 and uranium coal again. We're in an area that has high radon, but let's bury our rock and then do our test. Okay, we're gonna do small sweeps with the radio code. And I'm just gonna report back to we're at 972 counts per minute right now. You can also hear it on the phone as we get closer on the Android. But we're still sitting at 982, 992, 1000. And let's see if it starts picking it up. The phone is where the uranium ore is. And again, it's about eight, seven and a half, eight inches down. Oh, and you can actually, here we go. So it's currently picking up 5,000, 6,000, just under, you can hear that thing going crazy, 7,000 counts per, per minute. And it did find it. It actually overloaded the, <laughs> the phone. Let's go back again. If you are searching for uranium ore. It's actually overloading the phone's voice. Okay, so that's the radio code 110. So unfortunately, the only complaint I have with the RACID is there's no screen on the RACID, so you have to use the app. So, try and finagle this here. We're gonna come down. We're going to do a screen recording start. Also, let's keep it here so we don't get a disconnect from the Bluetooth. And we're gonna start sweeping. All right, sweeping, sweeping. I'm also gonna have the video of the race it up on the screen, as you can see. Oh, there it is. And it's currently, as you can see, 220, 230 counts per second. So that's the race at finding its target. So there you go. That is the radio code 110 and the race at 7% finding our piece of uranium ore. So you guys decide which one is better for you. The uh, race it is a little more expensive, but I feel you get somewhat more features. Downside being you have to use your phone, Android only. The radio code 
you can see the screen and it has the built-in app as well. Both excellent units, so this was just a quick comparison side-by-side, -side, radio code versus racid. Leave in the comments if you have either and which one you think won this competition. Like and subscribe, guys, and see you on the next video. Stay safe, be curious, don't get contaminated. All right, guys, have a good rest of your week.